talk tomorrow, guys. Alderman Ricardo Munoz keeping quiet for now about an alleged New Year's Eve attack on his wife, Betty Torres Munoz. But Torres Munoz is no longer staying silent. It's taken a lot of courage for me to get to this point to try and diminish the shame of living with an addict, a womanizer. The alderman pleaded not guilty to one count of misdemeanor domestic battery. Torres Munoz told police her husband pushed and hit her during an argument at their little village home. Police saying he left before they arrived. Officers arrested the alderman yesterday morning at his 22nd ward office, a ward he's represented for 25 years. He announced in the summer that he would not seek another term. I didn't come forward sooner because of his public image. And I didn't want this because I'm entitled to my privacy. Torres Munoz filed for an order of protection yesterday. They have been together for 34 years, married for 30. She is now finally ready to move on. She says she wishes him the best. I have to forgive him in a sense in order for me to move on. Um, I don't want to carry that burden with me anymore. Alderman Munoz is out on a $2,500 bond. A judge told him not to have any contact with his wife. His next court appearance is set for January 23rd. He plans to make a comment about the alleged incident tomorrow. So we'll see if he does. We'll it. Wait for that. OK, well, thank you. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.